Hey, how are we doing today? It's gonna be a very quick vlog. I wanna talk about how to handle situations when you get in an argument with someone or you're frustrated with someone. It could be in a relationship, it could be at work, it could be with a family member. But I wanna talk about how to disarm yourself when you're getting in a mood or you're just like not really yourself and how to identify that stuff, okay? So I wanna talk about this acronym called HALT. So HALT is a thing it's very popular. If you go and look it up online, you'll see that people are talking about it. But I want to actually, I want to bring it up because I really think it's a very practical way to recognize when you're not yourself and you're doing things that aren't representative of your character or how you really feel. Okay, so what does it mean? It means hungry, angry, lonely, or tired. So the practicality in this is when we are hungry, when we are angry, when we are lonely, or we're tired, we're not ourselves. Seriously, physiologically, we're not ourselves. I'm not the same Evan when I'm hungry. I have a different physiology when I'm hungry. So, my advice for today, it's a very quick vlog, is when you find yourself getting into an argument, more often than not, you're gonna identify one of those things in that acronym that is probably causing your problems. So what you gotta do is when you feel yourself getting detracted, feel yourself going down a path where it's like, Gosh, why doesn't this person understand what I'm saying? Gosh, why, why aren't these people doing what they're supposed to be doing? Stop, recognize halt, and ask yourself if you're in one of those situations. And if you are, blame, you gotta blame our stupid, primitive human physiology for it. It's, it has nothing to do with you. It has nothing to do with you as a person. What it is, is you as a human being, as an animal, are reacting because there's things in your body that are changing. So the advice for today is really just focusing on a halt and I'm hoping that people who are you know, following this piece of practical advice, they go and they find more information on it because I, I, I thought it was the stupidest thing when I heard it. I was like, halt, pff, what the, I don't care about that. Like, I know what I'm hungry, I know what I'm angry. You know how many times I got in stupid fights with my girlfriend? Family members, friends, coworkers. And I'm done now because it's just like, I stop and I'm like, damn, I gotta like, you know those like Snickers commercials where like the guy says you're not yourself, go have a Snickers? I wouldn't recommend going to go eat a Snickers, probably have like an apple or something, but yeah. When you really think about something as simple as that, and you have an acronym to remember it by, it just makes a difference. So for today, you know, this is a really good way for you to be able to control like slipping through and like just, you know, lashing out at someone, because no one wants to do that, right? We all want to see each other succeed. We want to see each other thrive. No one, and you know, the world is not against you. The world really only wants to see you do well. I mean, there's a couple people who are just miserable, but there's way more people who want to see you do good things. There's way more people who want to see good people in the world. Like it's just, that's just, there's a majority of good people and a minority of bad people. So don't think that everyone's out to get you. And it seems like that when you're hungry, angry, lonely, and tired, it seems like everyone's doing something to detract you, to like bring you down, but that's not what's going on. It's, it's a physiological response to how your body is just acting at the moment. I'm not a bi, I'm not a freaking doctor. There's nothing special about me, but I'm definitely someone who's like really kind of had to like understand that this is a thing. This is really a thing. Like hangry is a real thing. So if you are in that situation, hopefully that, that, that this acronym will help you. All right, I hope you enjoy this little vlog and uh, sorry it's really quick, but that's all I got for today. Got a lot of things going on and I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good day, everyone.